Patriots! He's always so quiet on the film. So what is needed to keep a Sammy Ed bright white and beautiful like this? Well, I really don't use anything at all. I mean, you saw in the, the grooming video that I sprayed him down with a conditioning and water spray, like a human people conditioner, hair conditioner, and then, which was white colored, and water mixed together, shaken, and sprayed on him. That's all I use for him because it helps soften his coat and it just makes him smell really, really nice. So what I do is I brush him every day, well, a few times a month, and then I normally just do a quick groom of him a few times a week. And that quick room is like pretty quick, like 15 minutes or so is all he can really stand. Whenever he goes outside and gets dirty, because Yeti's coat always stays beautiful white and fuzzy like this, even after he's wet and dirty and covered in mud, just give it a few hours to dry. Ouch, Yeti, don't bite. Just give him a few hours to dry and then he will be beautiful because he goes back to looking this beautiful bright white. I don't know what it is about a Sammy Ed coat that makes them repellent to dirt, but it's wonderful because you'd think that owning one of these guys would require constant bathing, and constant drying with a blow dryer, which Yeti does not like the blow dryers at all, but it doesn't really require much at all, except for the grooming, which is pretty epic. <laughs> Me growing to short gray hair, <laughs> of course, eliminates my time spent in front of the mirror with drying my hair so I can spend more time with Yeti Dog. Thank you so much, you guys, for joining Yeti and I today on Yeti's Place. I am the mother of Sammy Eds. Be sure to subscribe and click that bell notification for more videos.